Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Darius from DariusCooks.tv. One of my favorite desserts gets an upgrade. It's the peach cobbler trifle with white Hennessy cream. You're going to love it. Let's get started. First thing you wanna do is let's focus on the topping first. We're gonna take room temperature butter. I'm gonna mix that with a little bit of white sugar, a pinch of salt, and flour. That's pretty much it. I'm gonna crumble it together until it forms large clumps, and I'm gonna lay it out on a sheet tray and then put it off in the oven 400 degrees, 10 to 12 minutes until it's nice and golden brown. When it comes out the oven, it'll still be a little soft, so don't freak out. You're, you're right where you need to be, but as it cools, it's gonna harden, and it's gonna remind me of those lunchroom butter cookies we used to have back when I was in high school. You're gonna love it. The next part of the recipe is really simple. It's time for the actual cake part to be cooked. So instead of using dough, we're gonna use my vanilla buttermilk cake recipe. Super simple to do. We're gonna take a big bowl, and in the bowl we're gonna add in some buttermilk with a little bit of sugar, and then also I'm gonna add in some vegetable oil. I'm gonna whisk that together until it's well combined. Then we're gonna add in two eggs, a good amount of vanilla, and then for the rest of the dry ingredients, it's gonna be a pinch of salt, some baking soda, and then two and a half cups of flour are gonna go in. You're gonna combine that until it's nice and smooth. Into prepared ramekins, it goes off into the oven. The oven's at 350 degrees. It's gonna bake until it's golden brown, about 10 to 12 minutes and you're good to go. Now let's make the filling for the trifle. I'm gonna start with some butter, obviously. Then I'm gonna add in frozen peaches, some ground cinnamon, a little bit of white sugar, some brown sugar has to go in, some vanilla, a pinch of salt, a little bit of fresh squeezed lemon juice, a little bit of nutmeg is gonna finish this whole situation off. Let that come to a boil, it's gonna be nice and thick. To make it even thicker, I'm gonna take a little bit of cornstarch and water, mix it together to form a cornstarch slurry, and then I'm gonna pour that right into that peach mixture. When that comes together, this is going to be the best peach cobbler filling you have ever had in your entire life. Now it's time to make the whipped cream so we can assemble the trifles. Into my mixture, I'm gonna add cold, heavy cream. Some brown sugar goes in, some white sugar goes in, a touch of cinnamon, some vanilla, and then you guessed it, the white Hennessy. I'm gonna put the mixture on low to begin with so everything comes together. And as that cream starts to really come together, I'm gonna turn the mixture up and let it go until stiff peaks have been formed. Then we put everything together. I'm gonna to take the cake, cut it into cubes. Those are gonna go in first. I'm then gonna add in that lovely peach mixture right on top. Lastly, a lot of that whipped cream is gonna go on top of that. And I'm gonna finish off with just a sprinkle of those crunchy butter cookie crumbles. This dessert, hands down, is gonna get you everything you need. You put this out, it's over. I guarantee it. Recipe, you know where it's gonna be. It's up on our website, it's gonna be DariusCooks.tv. There's two things I gotta tell you as I always do. Food is my life, life, it's my food. Until next time, with a dessert as delicious as this, I gotta wish you happy cooking from my heart to yours.